there was something I read recently. I think it was Sahil Bloom. It was, it was based on something that he saw on Reddit, but it said the only people that will remember you working late 10 years from now are your kids. Right. And the idea was that as hard as you want to grind and work and think that you're solving these big problems for yourself and getting ahead financially and all that, if it comes at the expense of the relationship with your kids, that is that is a far greater cost than whatever potential opportunity you might be pursuing. Right. The notion of retirement and like running away from your W-2 job. I love my team. I love the work that I do. I find it very engaging. So I don't want it to come across as like, oh, I hate what I do and I can't wait to get out of here. And like you said, the freedom to generate income without your complete involvement is super fascinating to me. And I live in Atlanta, but my family kind of lives all over the Southeast. So I have to be very intentional about the time that I take and set aside to, to see them. And unfortunately, that's a little bit limited just by the nature of W-2 and things like that, you know, because years can go by and you can only see them a couple times a year. I want to do the exact same thing that you talk about, right? I want to be there for all the, the, the baseball practices and the ballet recitals and things like that. Those are the things that you'll never be able to get back, right? I want to make sure that I have as much flexibility during those crucial years that I would never, ever want to take for granted.